Well, they make our holiday meals and desserts complete. That's pecans. But this year, we're pecans, we're pecans. <laughs> where you're from. But this year, there's a shortage on them, really. That shortage is even right here in the Brazos Valley. And KAG's HG News reporter Monica Castro shows how this year's crop will affect the prices. For many, the holidays are about pecan pastries. But Johnny Wallace likes them by themselves. Oh, they're good. I love them. <laughs> it's pretty standard to see an increase in prices because the demand is so high. A lot more pecan usage here in the fall, as, as you might expect. But it's not just the holidays taking a toll on pecan supply. This year, trees had an off year. In, an, in a heavy crop year, it stresses the trees, and then the following year, they, uh, they just don't produce as much. They're, in a sense, resting. So prices have gone up slightly everywhere, even at Royalty Pecan Farm. We don't have the, the, the uh, crop on the trees to, to offset the input costs, and uh, that's what drives the price of the final product up. From $5.29 to $5.99 a pound this year. And in the future, international demand could create more increases. China is a big player in the market now, and, and they're a potential customer for us, and there are other countries as well, India. While many buy despite the increase, consumers like Johnny miss the old prices. Oh, I was paying about at least two something a pound, you know, or three. So instead of stocking up on the pecans, she buys just a few to snack on. Monica Castro, KAGS HD News. While pecan trees here and nationally didn't produce as much, experts say the pecans sold are the same quality.